In this video, we'll explain how to use the navigation features in the RTA Smart Drive app. To navigate to a place, you'll first need to select it. If you're interested in more information on how to select a place, we recommend watching our other videos. To start navigation, tap the Navigate To button. A dialog will appear with up to three car routes. A pedestrian route will appear if the total distance is less than 20 kilometers. Select the desired route and tap OK. To load a previously saved route, Open the main menu and tap on My Routes. If you're interested in more information on how to plan and save routes, we recommend watching our other videos. Tap the route you wish to load and then tap the Load button. To start navigation, tap Drive. If you're near the starting point of your route, you'll be navigated to the route destination. However, if you're far from the starting point, you'll first be navigated to the beginning of the route and then to the destination. When navigation starts, the app will automatically begin tracking you. You can still explore the map by panning it. If you're interested in more information on how to control the map, we recommend watching our other videos. To resume tracking, tap the arrow symbol in the center of the dock. Tap the map to show or hide the zoom button and compass. If you want to manually adjust the zoom level, use the zoom buttons or place two fingers on the screen and spread or pinch them. If you want the application to automatically adjust the zoom level based on your drive, tap the Auto button. If you wish to stop the navigation session, tap the root icon on the dock, then tap End. The distance to your next maneuver and its symbolic description are displayed above the dock in yellow. The distance remaining to your destination and the estimated time of arrival are displayed in white. If you accidentally go over the legal speed limit while driving, the speed limit symbol will be displayed in the upper left corner and you'll be warned by a gentle sound. When you get near your destination, the parking zone number around your current location will be displayed above the dock. While navigating in tracking mode, a short list of petrol stations along your route will be displayed in the upper right corner. On-street parking zones that are close to your destination will also appear there. To access a full list, tap the item. If you wish to make a detour and pass through a place on the list, tap the Pass Through button. If you change your mind, tap the item again, followed by Cancel. During navigation, live traffic information is used to automatically calculate the quickest way to your destination. The detailed route dialog contains a switch you can use to turn automatic rerouting off. If you switch automatic rerouting off, a bar with the graphical representation of traffic and expected delays on your route 
will be displayed. Thank you for watching this video.